Pegi 12. Hi, I'm King, and I'm here with Sarah today, who's going to walk us through an exciting new feature in The Sims 3 Showtime called Simport. Thanks, King. I'm really excited to talk about Simport today. It's a really fun way that you can share your Sims with your friends by actually sending them to your friend's game. And along the way, you're going to pick up really cool new content. First off, you're going to need at least two Sims in your household. And at least one of those Sims needs to be a level two in any one of the new performance careers in Showtime. And of course, you also need to be logged into your Origin account. The key to Simport is basically the Simport book, and that's accessible through your Sims phone or computer or the options menu here. And from here, you can send a request to send a Sim or host a Sim. And this is also where you see all of the tour requests from all of your friends. So this is the Acrobat page. I can see here that I don't have a stamp yet for this tour stop, and the green icon indicates that my Sim is eligible and ready to go on tour. All I have to do is click here, select my Sim, select you, my friend, King Machine, and click OK. You can post a request to a specific friend or to all of your friends. If you post to all of your friends, you'll have a better chance at your tour request being accepted. I have a message here that says Sims Nelson wants me to host her Sim Granny Gummy Bones. So I click Go to Simport, Accept. So how long do I have to accept your request? You have a day. Now you should see a message there that tells you when and where my Sim is going to perform. Also if you go to Town View, you'll see a map tag that also tells you when the show is going to start. I'll send my Sim there now. Oh look, I get to set up a stage. I'll put some lights here, this backdrop there, looks great. What an awesome sim. Now see, if I had sent her with custom content, you wouldn't see any of that in your game. To make sure your computer stays safe, we never send any custom content. This little old lady is doing some crazy contortions. Oh my gosh, let me see, post a picture. All you have to do is take a memory and post it to your player wall. Here you go. Oh, she looks awesome. Now, if you click on the stage, you can see that you should have a variety of interactions you can do. You can make a request or even throw stuff at my sim on stage. Hey, wait a minute. I just got a report from my show that says you booed her. I didn't know you were going to get a report. Yep. If you interact with my sim while I'm still online, I will get reports about what's going on with my sim. Here's a message in my game that says I completed the tour stop. I got a stamp. So for each page you fill with stamps, you unlock a new reward set. So do I need to use Simport to get to the top of my career? Nope. Simport is totally optional. What happens when we're not playing our games and online at the same time? You still have a day to accept the request, but in my game, Granny Gummy Bones will come back in her cab after about 12 sim hours. If you've accepted the request, I'll get a report on how the show went. If you don't accept the request or it expires, I'll get a message telling me that you never made it to the show, and then I'll know I have to send out another tour request to try and get that stamp. Here comes Granny Gummy Bones back in her cab, and I got some mullions and another stamp, and even some career experience. I love it. 